Well, that ended happily, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, I could have done with a car chase. So that happens now. Oh my God. So I'll leave you alone for five seconds and this is what I come back to. I turned me back for five minutes and my own daughter's tashing on with me boyfriend. Oh, get over yourself. You swanned off on holiday after nearly killing his kids and you nicked his money on the way out. The two people that I love most in the world. You might as well have stabbed us in the heart. Don't you dare paint yourself as the victim. We didn't even know if you were coming back. Of course I was coming back. Like the damn fool that I am, I was missing the pair of you. Oh, you've got a funny way of showing it. I just thought that we could clear the air and go back to normal. Normal? What's that? Bullying a seven-year-old at the covering for you because you left her on her own? No, that's not Or setting fire to the house when you were supposed to be babysitting? You have never been normal for one second of your life. Nick and me man, not enough for you, no. You have to rip into us about the mistakes that anybody could have made. Oh, for God's sake. How long did you wait, eh? A week? A day? You must have been made up when you thought I was gone forever. OK, firstly, we'd finish. It doesn't matter who I see. And secondly, you can't just waltz in here and start calling the shots. I like Amy, and you being back here doesn't change that one bit. Right, I see. All I wanted was for things to go back to the way they were. But I guess now you two have chosen each other, I'm just gonna have to try and get used to it. Not only with what's happened to us, I just wish you could have waited for us a little bit longer. All right, go on then, I'm biting. What's happening now? I know I've never been the perfect mum, which is why I'm really pleased I'm getting another go at it. Now I've got all my mistakes out of the way. What do you mean, getting another go at it? I'm having a baby, Amy. Nandy's the dad. <laughs>